Hey, what's up, guys? Vimpure coming at you with another one of these videos. We're going to be playing some good old Stronghold Wars. 1v1v1s, really fun, a Stronghold TD kind of version. Um, I kind of like it. It's pretty fun. So, But there's a little bit of a twist to this game. So essentially, I did let, let know uh, the lobby that if they managed to finish me off or, you know, do the finishing blow, that sounded kind of weird, but you know what I mean? If they if they beat me, you know, if they be Oh, my God. Oh, dude. Oh, this intro. Oh, no. <laughs> Stop it. Get some help. Yeah, so anyways, if they beat me, they get five bucks. As simple as that. If you finish, you know, if you you kill me and it's pretty much done, I have to give you five bucks. As simple as that. It's a fun, you know, kind of a twist and a little bit of stakes to the game. So if you guys enjoyed this type of content, let me know down in the comments. But my way to kind of like, you know, hype things up pretty much. So enjoy the video. Decided to add a little bit of more stakes because the game is kind of like, I don't know, it feels like kind of boring. So... Might as well make it a little bit more interesting, right? Uh, let's let's actually focus up a little bit so I don't die. That would be kind of embarrassing, you know, at the beginning. <laughs> Imagine. Dude, I did concoct a little bit of a strategy, right? So, listen, Vimp is ready. Somewhat, okay? Somewhat ready. So, we'll see how it goes. Um, anyone can win five bucks. So, it's, it's for the fun of it, right? It's for your entertainment, guys. Uh, it's not serious, you know? It's just uh, fun stuff, basically easy. <laughs> Listen, dude, don't be toxic. Chill, man. Yeah, so, I mean, I don't know how this is going to go, honestly. I really don't. Like, I'm hoping this goes fine, you know? So, basically, strategy-wise, what you want to do is get a lot of income from just upgrading structures, right? Instead of actually just, um, what's it called? Sending units, you upgrade structure, your main building, and it actually gives you quite a bit of income. So, that's my kind of game plan at the moment. A little bit of slow, pretty much all over the uh, the maze. Just slow the units down a little bit, right? Um, get that income up, right? That's the most important thing is keep spamming that income key. Just spam as many units as you can. Keep tacking up. Let's get us some of these auras on the hotkey so we can just upgrade them whenever we wish. Uh, pretty much just all tab between them. And that's pretty much it. So I kind of want to take up to grunts at this point. I don't know why. I <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah, so basically, again, taking up is the best option. Look at my income, right? It's it's really freaking good. It's, and I didn't even send that much. I mean, I did send a, a bit, right? I did send a bit. Um, I don't know. We'll do like five rounds. We'll do five rounds. Hopefully, five rounds is enough. Um, and hopefully, I don't lose enough, like too much money, right? <laughs> Yo, this is so bad. Who came up with this idea? I don't want to lose five bucks every time I die. What is this? Okay, I'm going to have to be ruthless, guys. I literally, I'm going to be forced to be ruthless and like really go ham on these guys right and really go ham and just like not care about their, their emotions whatsoever and send really high tier units i feel like that's what i'm gonna do it's literally what i'm gonna do right i'm gonna wait a little bit here so i can tack up i I'm, i see these grunts incoming right so i kind of like want to build oh i almost felt a very important tower would have been bad let's get these next tier and we're gonna be going straight to tier six units and this is gonna be very tough for my opponents to kind of hold if they're not ready Wait a second. Yo. Hello? Yeah, we're good. We're good. Oh my god. I thought was, I was going to die there for a second. Would have been kind of bad. Would have been definitely really bad. <laughs> Imagine, dude. Please. Come on, man. I cannot die this early. Dude. Holy. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Easy. <laughs> dude, he's so toxic. Dude, what the hell? <laughs> Dude, it's such a random guy. <laughs> Come on, man. Don't be that toxic. What's wrong with you, man? Uh, let's get a little bit more. I feel like ores are fine. We got a decent amount of towers. Kind of want to tech up here. I feel like let's wait for one more income. And uh, start getting some very nice auras in the mix. Like, so. Keep sending units. Build up that income. I have still have highest income, which is good. Easy. Indeed. <laughs> Dude, this guy, man. Um, can I even get boats? I actually can. I'll get one boat. Just in case, right? Just in case so I don't die. Because that would be tragic. That would be definitely tragic. So I've been doing a little bit of a strategy. Essentially, I'm building a little bit of units up front. Reason being is I kind of want to thin out the wave. So it doesn't like come to my side and it's like massive over here. So I want to have, to, you know, a slightly, you know, thinner wave. That would be the ideal case scenario. Keep upgrading the, uh, you know, 
our auras to the best of our ability. This guy seems to be sending next tier. So now we're going to be going for a lot and a lot of... I mean, let's go for two boats. I feel like two boats is ideal here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at that. Look at that. All of these dudes are going to be super low coming into my side. So this is super good. So I can kind of check his tech, by the way. Another, like, pro strat. You can see what tech this guy is at. It's pretty much next tech or something like that. Let's go for our next tech here. Hopefully... Keep sending, keep building that income. We kind of have to like differentiate ourselves just by building different, well, just getting that extra income. I feel like that that pretty much what makes a really good player. So I don't know what's the capability of this guy. So I kind of have to, you know, be relatively safe. Cause again, five bucks is on the line. This guy's a little bit toxic. I can't, dude, I cannot give this guy five bucks. There's no way, like I refuse. This is the last thing on earth I'm gonna do is give this guy five bucks. Like I can't, I can't condone toxic, toxic people, right? That would be, that would be something else. I can't do that, right? Uh, so let's start building a few archers, I think. Uh, go for next tech. I feel like uh, get a little bit of archers, right? We can start sending um, these Nisha, not Nishas, but uh, sabers, basically. I feel like it's fine. Um, I hate say sending those golems, but I feel like I kind of have to. We do have archers in the back, so I'm not too worried. This guy's sending tier fours. I'm kind of okay. Okay. Listen, I I get it. I get it. He's a good competitor. He's a good competitor, but you know, sometimes you got to teach these uh, trash talkers how it's done, right? Sometimes you got to like, you know, smack that booty, smash that booty, you know? And that's literally what we're going to be doing. So, uh, let's get this. These auras set up. Uh, get you. Uh, misclicks. A little bit of misclicks here and there, you know. It's completely fine. Uh, get that last year. Start sending Illidans are very tough. They're very freaking tough. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We're good, we're good. Are we good? I hope we're good. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Oh my god, that was kind of scary. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Okay, so the trick is sending a lot of like random units, like tier tier twos basically, create a huge wave, and then go for a bigger spawn basically. So like afterwards you go for Illidan. So that's pretty much the strategy when it comes to like this game. I should be able to defend this no problem. Like he's gonna have to deal with all of this. Now all I have to do is just defend, which I'm gonna fully focus on just that. Because if I die, I'm gonna be pretty tilted here. Uh, let's go for archers, as many as we can. Yeah, it's a lot of, you know, demons, but hopefully it's going to be enough for to be able to defend. Let's see. We should be able to, right? Oh, no. Oh, my. F <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Get out of here, you noob. Emotional damage. Oh, it so feels... Yeah, sure. Go remake. <laughs> he just left. Yeah, sure. <laughs> He's so upset. He's so upset. Oh, my God. Oh, that's five bucks more in my bank account. Let's freaking go. Let's go for round two. All right. So, the uh, you know, the lobby has been informed. Let's go for round two, boys. Let's go for round two. Five bucks is on the line. Like it's a lot of money or something, you know. <laughs> good luck, good luck. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's, you know, you, you squared. What? <laughs> I mean, I'm, listen, I feel like it's a, it's a, it's not much, but I feel like it's fun. It adds a little bit of a, a little bit of a twist to the game, you know? So we'll see how, you know, players, if they try hard a little bit more, money is on the line or whatever. I feel like it's always more interesting. Let's say you play a, you know, a game of cards with your friends. Yeah, the little bit of money, even if it's five bucks, I feel like it might get a little bit more interesting because there's stakes. There's stakes, guys. You know how you know how people do. People get emotional. People start, you know, panicking, or, you know, or whatever. So I feel like it's good. It's good. We might get a good game. <laughs> Let's hope at least. Let's hope at least. I, it really depends on the lobby. If the lobby is any good, we could probably get away with a pretty good game. But honestly, I'm not even getting any freaking units at the moment. So I'm kind of. I don't know, I'm kind of confused. Okay, now I'm finally getting peasants, which is good. Took took up a little bit, but you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. 
Uh, like, I don't even know. Like, okay, so he literally died. <laughs> he died, dude. Amateurs, dude. <laughs> dude, what's wrong with Warcraft, man? People are so toxic. What the hell? Dude, what is wrong with Warcraft, man? I, I really want to see if I can actually get a tech up quick here. Yeah, let me see if I can get a quick tech up and uh, get a water elemental tower. I feel like that would be the best. Yeah, this is probably the best start I've ever gotten because I didn't even get any pressure. So this is obviously really freaking good for me because I don't have to spend too much on defenses. Even though, you know, you see these uh, priests coming in. doesn't really matter, honestly. We're just going to keep uh, going about our business. And, you know, let's go for uh, a little bit of a, you know, a nice little montage for mid game. Let's get it! So won't you just give it up because you don't understand? Big it up, but you don't understand. And it's really nice, but you don't understand. So big it up because you don't understand. Yeah. You don't understand, baby. Be in real danger. This world ain't simple. But I'm strong. Oh my god, it was such a close one. Jesus Christ, I thought I was gonna die there for a second there. Oh ho 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 ho. Yeah, I kinda have to watch out, man. Kinda have to be not so greedy after all, eh? Because uh, one wrong move and that's five bucks down the drain, baby. <laughs> Alright, so let's keep getting these upgrades. Make sure that we're not kind of falling behind, which is kind of important, right? And uh, yeah, we're slowly but surely building up our income lead, which is the most important thing I have to do at the moment. Uh, kind of build some auras here and there, you know. Um, sending archers. Pretty much at the same area that we are at, I feel like. Um, we're a little bit ahead in income, I guess. Or, you know, it's kind of... You know, it's actually pretty close. It's actually pretty close. So I'm actually going to start getting maybe next here. I was thinking here. I'm missing a little bit of gold, am I? Beauty. Okay. Easy. <laughs> he was the one trash talking, at, by the way. So that's why. Amateur. <laughs> Dude. Oh my god. Taste of his own medicine. Absolute beauty. That is a work of art, to say the least. Jesus Christ. I love how he called people amateurs and he's the one being like told amateur afterwards. Wow. That is a love story and a half. Yeah, it's typical to work after. Did he leave? Oh, he did leave. <laughs> oh, this game is gold. This game is gold, I'm telling you. Got pretty much everything. Hot keyed on the bright side. Now we can keep sending these revenants. And I feel like the best is just going for next tier. And we'll see. We'll see. You're not too pressured to do anything at this point. Because the amount of units that are being sent here are not, like, significant. I would say. But let's see. These guys have been... Uh, they're been doing, doing pretty well. Considering, you know, they're doing pretty well. So here comes a... Okay, that's a problem. Oh, show. I'm going to go for a uh, tech up here. Get some archers in the mix. Why not? Uh, I feel like archers are kind of important at this point. Um, I do want to get myself... Okay, so let's get archers even in the back here. Because, oh, that's a problem. That's definitely a problem. That's a lot of freaking units coming in. And I'm not really ready. Honestly. I'm going to lose a little bit of income doing this. But I have to. I literally have to or else I'm dead. Here we go. Dude, green fell. Make sure that we focus down the proper targets. Oh, wait. Am, am I dead? Oh, my God, dude. Oh, my God. That was so freaking close. That was literally so freaking close. How did I survive that, guys? How? How? Can someone tell me? Dude, I could have just died and lost right there. And Oh, dude, that would have been bad. <laughs> I, I want to go late game. I definitely do want to go late game. I have to put up a fight. I have to put up a fight because if I don't, that would be... I'd be so disappointed. I'd be so freaking disappointed. Illidan's coming in. Not looking too good for me, honestly. Um, I have to keep building. As long as I keep building, I feel like I'm relatively fine. But still, these guys are, you know, they're good. They're good. Income-wise, they're a little bit ahead, which is not good for me. Not good for me. Not good for me. I have to keep building towers. Hopefully that's going to be enough. I really can't tell, honestly. I have to keep getting this uh, next tier. Because uh, this is going to give me a little bit more HP, which is kind of important. I'm taking a little bit of damage, but I feel like it's totally normal. 
get last tier and at this point we do the same strategy as before so send lower tier and then we go straight for illidans which is pretty much the strategy look at the amount of illidans coming in oof that's gonna be a problem guys that's literally gonna be a problem but I could, try, I could try to compensate with like because the thing is they, they're also sending um illidan so i could probably do the same with like third tier units that would help with their pushes so let's see oof yeah that's a lot of freaking units guys that's a lot I don't, I don't think i'm gonna be able to defend but i'll try my best yeah i'm probably dead here yeah i'm for sure dead right there's no way i defend this I'm dead. GG. Oh, no! Yellow. That's such a low. <laughs> Go my Discord. <laughs> well played. No! That's so unfortunate. And he has no freaking towers, man. If he, if he goes, that would be awesome. Uh, but yeah, that's GG. I guess I owe him five bucks. Man, that's unfortunate. Five bucks down the drain. Dude, how does he survive that? All right, grudge match. Listen, Mr. Yoda is back. He's back for revenge. He wants an extra five bucks. He's such a greedy little little Yo little Yoda, you know? That's ah, uh, dude, it's it's so frustrating. How can he lose to Mr. Yoda, man? Baby Yoda, really? I, I could for sure do better. I could for sure do better. This time, I'm redeeming myself, and I'm getting this win. I don't care. Whatever it takes, I'm getting this win, okay? A low amount of sense, so this is pretty good for me. I could just pretty much send, send tier once, or pretty much get a few tires. Don't need to, like, overcommit on them. I really want to kill Mr. Yoda. Like, really freaking bad. Like, really freaking bad. Oh, man, it's so triggering. I owe this guy five bucks. He hasn't messaged me for some reason. I don't know why. Like, you, you got a free... Free five bucks? Come on, man. Claim it, please, for the love of God. Just claim it. Just take your five bucks, run away with it while you can. That's all I have to ask. <sighs> As you can see, I'm kind of tilted. <laughs> My five bucks. I'm just, kidding. I'm just kidding, guys. I'm just kidding. Let's get a few of these because that's a lot of freaking units coming in, but we should be able to t handle it, no problem. So lethality is pretty much what we're missing. Let's get that. A little bit of extra damage. Can't say no to that. And uh, yeah, just keep getting these nice aura around the base. And we kind of want to tech up straight to tier 5. That's literally what we're going to do. Is go straight to tier 5. And see what we can, you know, create a little bit of damage. So I feel like these tier 5 are do quite a bit. Of, oh yeah, here we go. Now we're pressuring him quite a bit. So now he's going to be getting... Oh dude, look at this. He knows what he's doing. Okay, so this guy's actually a really good player. This guy's actually a really good player. So I feel like we have very solid competition to say the least right so yeah hopefully we get a good game out of this one um let's i guess move to mid game hopefully let's move to mid game oh show I feel like at this point if we get just wizard we should be fine no problem orange is down oh here we go a lot of players down that's good for me that's really good for me Ooh, wait a second No, 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 no. Oh my god, that was so freaking close. Dude, I thought I was gonna die there. Come on, come on. We can take him out. We can take him out. Come on, come on, come on. We got this. We got this. I believe. I believe. I believe. Oh, it's so freaking close. This guy's really freaking good, man. He knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. Oh no. We might have a game on our hands, boys. We might have a game. Okay, okay. I can beat this guy. It's only me versus him grudge match. It's only me versus him grudge match. I can do this. All I have to do is stay focused, get that income up, right? And just do what I do best is just play this game, you know, consistently, play it well, make no mistakes. Just keep focused, be focused, keep getting upgrades, get that income up. It's looking pretty good, guys. It's looking pretty good. Let's go for a tech up. Oh, wow. I'm a little bit lower in income. It seems like this guy is much more ahead. All right, just pausing the replay for a second here. I just kind of watching the replay, I noticed a little quick, uh, cool trick, a competitive trick that this guy, Mr. Yoda, is using to create this uh, income disparity between me and him. Essentially, what he's doing is keeping his towers lower tier. So you see he's keeping all of these towers into like these mortar teams, which do quite a bit of splash damage instead of going for the wizards that I'm pretty much utilizing to single target damage 
most of these towers, even though they do more damage, um, they're not, they don't do splash. So there's massing these lower tier, which essentially costs him less. And he's able to use that extra gold to pretty much go for income, which is what he's going to be doing a lot throughout the, the game. It's just a cool kind of like trick for you guys to note for your next games. I, like I'm doing A-OK, -okay, but this guy's really on top of his game. I'm not going to lie. He's really on top of his game. So I, I have to give him props. I really do. Tech up. Hopefully he's going for Cavaliers here. I'm going to start building a few more archers up front. Hopefully he has only one set of auras. Interesting. He's only building in the back, which is uh, OK, I guess. I don't think it's too bad of an idea, but I'm going to like spread out my units. I feel like that's a, maybe like an advantage I might have on him, but we'll see. It's really just up to me just to really carry this game here. Just go for maybe more auras. I feel like that's fine for now. Keep building more towers, more archers. That's the most important. Okay, so let's do the typical strategy. He's going to go for this. I'm going to go for this, then this, then this, and this. So like a lot of, as you see, a lot of units, random units spread into the, the, the mix. So that's what, really what differentiates, I guess, me and other players is I, I, tr I try, I do this strategy where I don't think a lot of people do. Is I really just up, send a lot of like random units at the beginning to just tank, right? They're essentially tanking for me. Okay, we might be in trouble. Let's see. Come on, come on. I can do this. I can do this. Oh, wow. He's really good. He's really good. Oh, no. <laughs> you got a really solid game on our hands. No. Dude. <laughs> okay, this is... We're finishing this off with a freaking banger, to say the least. Okay, keep sending. Keep sending. Keep building. Again, just send a lot of tier one units. A lot of tier one units. Okay, keep sending, keep sending. He's probably gonna send a lot of like demons at some point. Am I? There's no way I'm dead here, right? Right? I'm probably dead. Oh. Okay, that was close. Oh my god, that was so close. Oh my god, dude. What? Okay, let's go for it. Let's go for it. This is the time. Okay, he's going for demons, which I guess is fine. Oh, dude, that's a lot, though. I don't think I'm going to be able to defend that, honestly. All right, hope I can, because that's pretty much final blow. Oh, my Lord, oh, my Lord. <laughs> no, I think it's over. I think he wins again. Dude, this guy's too gifted, man. Ah, GG. Dude, I think he just, he just outplayed me. Again, he beats me, man. Well played, man. Well played. <laughs> oh, no! I'm so triggered! Oh, okay, J dude, listen. I can't beat Mr. Yuda. It's just that good. He has no demons. How is that even possible? Later. Okay. Man, what a game. What a game. Dude, I owe him 10 bucks. I owe him 10 bucks. It is what it is. Sometimes, oh, dude, I can't believe I lost 10 bucks to this guy. I hate this game. Oh my God. If you guys want to see more of these, please like the video. I have to pay for this, you know, pay for this somehow. So please like the video if you enjoyed. If you want to see more challenges, let me know down in the comments if you guys have any ideas. But shout out to Mr. Yoda. Well played. Listen, I'm going to give it to him. He played better. Even though I thought I was playing better, but I don't know, man. I had just so much more defenses. I had more, it felt like more income. I guess he's just like, uh, his like finishing blow was a little bit faster than mine. And I just couldn't like handle it. But yeah, I just felt I had so many more towers. I guess they should have been more aggressive. Just save a little bit more. It is what it is. I mean, we learn, we learn, GG's. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this. I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Take care guys. Hopefully you guys, you know, have a good day.